My name is Jeffrey Sterling, a former CIA officer wrongfully convicted of violating the Espionage Act. It is an honor for me to celebrate Daniel Ellsberg Week because for me, Mr. Ellsberg is the very embodiment of truth and of whistleblowers. When the term whistleblower is uttered, you can't help but think of Daniel Ellsberg. But what is incredible to me is that, is that his passion for the truth has never ended. Vietnam and the Pentagon Papers were merely his opening salvo. He has championed whistleblowing and whistleblowers. And that passion has been just as enthusiastic in his drive and push for the eradication of nuclear weapons. But Mr. Ellsberg has been something even more important to me personally. You know, there are not that many who know what it's like to be persecuted under the Espionage Act. It, it is not a burden that anyone who embraces and fights for the truth should ever have to bear. When I emerged from prison, feeling quite lost, or quite hopeless, Dan Ellsberg reached out to me, you know, the Daniel Ellsberg reached out to me. And by doing so, he became a sort of savior for me. He knew what it was like to be unjustly labeled a traitor and all of the devastations that go along with it. He took it upon himself to share with me his experiences. And though I certainly can never compare myself to Dan Ellsberg, you know, I found a kinship with this great, eloquent man, and it uplifted me. He made me feel and realize that I wasn't alone, you know, that I was much more than the ordeal that I had been put through, and most importantly, that I had survived it. You know, sometimes all you need is someone to listen and understand. Now that's the sort of thing that whistleblowers go through. And Mr. Ellsberg was there for me in that most fundamental yet crucial way. So it is a tremendous honor for me to be able to celebrate this week for Daniel Ellsberg. Whenever I think of what is left for me after a horrendous ordeal, I think of Dan Ellsberg as the example to follow. And I think we can all look to Daniel Ellsberg as the example to follow when it comes to truth and accountability. Thank you very much. And thank you, Daniel Ellsberg.